excited? How excited are you tonight? Uh, really excited. Uh, this is the biggest thing I've been nominated for, really, and I am really, I'm really nervous about it. Yeah. It's been a great year for Emmerdale. Uh, what, I mean, what do you think is what's the secret behind the success? Uh, Gavin Blythe, really. He's been the driving force behind everything, behind all the storylines you've been seeing over the past two or three years. It's you know, this past two years, it's been, it's been his baby, really, and it's down to him, his vision of driving it and me being here and it's all down to him really. And, and it's had a, a lot of big storylines of late um, with the crash and the fire. Is, is, is anything else going to top that this year? Is there anything coming up do you think? Yeah we've got some stuff coming up. Uh, I'm not really at liberty to say what we've got but there's a lot more twists and turns in Jackson and Aaron's story. There's a lot more twists and turns in Emmerdale really. There's some big stuff this year. Jackson and Aaron's story seems to have like really caught a lot of people's attention, really brought new people into the show. Is that, are you proud of how, how much it's caught the nation? Yeah, I'm extremely proud that when people think of some soaps, they think of certain partnerships and most of the time they're male and female and it's been absolutely fantastic that Emmerdale now is, when you think of the couples in Emmerdale, you think of Aaron and Jackson and it's, it's fantastic that I'm a part of that and it's fantastic that we've brought sort of a gay young relationship to the forefront is brilliant. Where would you like to see their relationship go in the long term? Oh, in the long term, I think it's going to be difficult for them to be happy together. Uh, I, I think I'd like to just see them be together and be happy, and whether that's with each other as boyfriends or whether that's just with each other as mates, that's what I hope is going to happen. But it's going to be a few twists and turns before then. East Enders and Corey have had live episodes last year. Would you like a, an Emmerdale to give it a go? Oh, I think it'd be difficult for us because we've got the village and we've got the studios. But yeah, it'd be a great thing to have a go at. I mean, there'll be a lot of nerves floating about. It'll be interesting to do, but we'll have to wait and see.